It's time to play The Witcher again. It's time to play The Witcher again. Honestly, I've been really conflicted about whether I would play an additional save file and just not tell you guys <laughs> so that I could keep going in the main story, but I haven't done that. I waited for you. He waited for you. <laughs> Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, everybody. Come on in. Re3, thank you for cheering and starting us off with some maximum hype. Appreciate you. Peach wants revenge and Kitty Cat. Kitter. Kitter Cat. Cat. Kitter Cat. Welcome back for 16 months. Yes. Look, my friends, uh, The Witcher 3. Uh, I love it. Uh, uh, Gwent, I love it. Uh, we're a level 4 Witcher. Um, I've been eating a lot of raw meat in combat because I don't know, can I cook it? Like Zelda, can I Breath of the Wild cook this meat? Because I've just been feeding the Witcher raw meat. Well, and that's, that's okay. It's fine because we apparently are immune to most diseases uh, as a Witcher, as a mutant. And um, what else can I tell you? Oh, uh, I, 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 it's not like I got 100% in this White Orchard area. Like, I've got 101%, I was telling Saps. And I'll tell you what, that... Uh, I need to play this game right now. Um, should we jump into it? <laughs> yeah. Let's just get to it. Should we just get to it? I'm Went I, is life. Hey, gamer bros, it's your birthday. Hey, Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Good to you. Good to see you. And thank you guys all for retweeting to invite your friends. We got a, a tweet just up there. Uh, now, if you'd like to invite your friends, we've got our, our, our good old standby. Where's our little pin? There it is. Ah, oh, yes. We have probably 50 of these pins left, mm -hmm. and uh, we want to give them around the world. So all you got to do is be here with us, uh, following the channel and typing in the chat when we call out for it. And I uh, appreciate you guys super, uh, super much. Super, super much. much. All of our subs get that five times entry. And if you give a gift sub on the channel, one or many, you are entered in 10 times for all of our giveaways on the stream. Brian? What, what? Is this Oreo dust right here? No, that's dirt. Yeah? That's it's Oreo flavored dirt. Hmm. Why are you calling me out like this? I don't know. Why? Just my little, my little section. Time to game. Time <laughs> to game. My little section has a whole bunch of oh, Oreo dust. You guys want to get into where crumbs are and aren't? <laughs> um, also, to ga damn, damn. <laughs> Lethargist, Why would you welcome. Call me out like that? Just, yeah. It's fucking twisted. A man eats Oreos. A man, man eats, eats Oreos. Oreos. Yeah, yeah. A man eats Oreos. Somebody back me up on that. <laughs> Lethargist is here for the first time. Thank you so much for joining us. <laughs> And Absurdist Ninja, thank you for the gift sub group hug. Hey, Absurdist Ninja. <laughs> thank you for the gift sub group hug. Appreciate you, friends. And if there's somebody out there, Pupker knows. Yeah, we're going to our life. Honestly. Somebody somebody make a note that uh, I'm supposed to call Amelia out on something on stream at some point. Just okay. to make her feel uncomfortable right as we're about to begin her favorite game. <laughs> Let's go. Please pass me the controller. Thank you. Ah! Off to a strong start. I appreciate you, Blue Crusher, and it's okay for me with the gift subs, the double gift subs, and Rezzy Senpai. Thank you for using your Prime. Did you guys know if you have Amazon Prime, you can link it to Twitch for a free subscription using Prime Gaming. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> All right, let's get the game audio up. Yeah, also, Jesse Silverblade, welcome back for 29 months. Hey. Vices and Discos, thanks for the gift sub, friend. And Rezzy Senpai, thanks for subscribing with your Prime. I see you gather before me. Brippa. We are gathered before. We are gathered before them. Destiny is all regular Oreos, Amidala. Regular standard issue Oreos. Sent by Miss Okami. They're my birthday Oreos. <laughs> also, you shouldn't get on someone for eating their own birthday Oreos, when in fact it was you that opened the packet of Oreos there in the first place, and I got one of the four pack of Oreos. There was many packs in the box. The, this dust <laughs> is from the pack that you opened and ate three-fourths of. Let's go. People want to game. This bard's tale Oreos. begins near White Orchard, with my dear friend Geralt of Rivia seeking his lover of yore. Yeah. The sorceress Yennefer. She deluded him for years, but now seems just a We gotta find this Yennefer. Ahead. She's just a few steps ahead. <laughs> um, I am addicted to Gwent already. I'm it's addicted true. to Gwent already. He's addicted to Gwent. Okay. So, this we're here at I gotta show you guys what's going on, just to catch you up to speed, okay? Quests, secondary quest. I gotta collect all these Gwent cards. Here, I'll show you like this full screen real quick. Beep. But I've gone through all these awesome side quests and I'm absolutely loving the game. 
And that being said, I want to show you that we have uh, we have one point available because I've just leveled up to four. So I thought we would start with this. Um, we want to build up our skill tree. The signs and alchemy are uh, lower up. I, my general, I haven't done any of these, any of these general ones. Does anybody have a general skill that they really love that they think would be a good one for a for a beginner? And thanks you guys for all the hype on the hype train. Yes, thanks friends. BC Talos, welcome back for 23 months. And wonderful Tsuki, thanks for being here 11 months. Appreciate cool. you. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, top left. And Quen's getting a lot of love too, huh? Mm. And gourmet. Gourmet, gourmet. Bear school techniques. Cat school techniques. Survival instincts. Where's gourmet? Metabolism boost? Oh, wow. There's a lot of them here. And this looks like gourmet. Yeah. Gourmet. Eating food regenerates vitality for 20 minutes. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I like where your instincts at. Um, I've done a lot of these uh, combat ones um, because I didn't realize there were other tabs. And uh, here we are together. Um, Igni, yeah, I'm using a lot of that on Axie. Um, we've got nine coins because I've gone shopping recently. My inventory, we got this smashing new outfit um, and some new swords. I'm carrying around a lot of swords because that's my life. Mm. Um, I've learned how I can uh, repair these items and how I can use the uh, the wheel to sharpen and upgrade my weapons. Your stuff. Uh, here you can see all the raw meat we store to eat um, here. These are our consumables. I just learned that if you hold down on the D-pad, you can switch between those two. And um, let's jump back into the main story quest. Eh? So last, uh, last week, we defeated a... Uh, Phoenix creature. No, a griffin. A griffin. That's what it is. Griffin. And um, you have chopped off its head, and you're going to take it to... One of these. Yeah. A griffin. Mm -hmm. And uh, the bestiary is updated like our Pokedex each time we slay or get into combat with this these creatures. And they all have different weaknesses that we Ooh. oil our blades. I absolutely hate these drowners, you that guys. That is a angry looking little guy the drowners stress me out more Ooh. than you know the sounds they make when they attack are really golemy the ghoul's not much better yeah yeah uh these guys are really fast Ooh, look at his chin yeah he's a necker yeah and uh the specters are um you know a devil by the well oh okay i, I, ran, I ran through this little side quest i was gonna hang on to it for you guys but the noon wraiths and the night wraiths and the they have really long maidens. really long tongues Okay. Really long time. I think these might be my favorite so far. That's horrible. <laughs> um, and then wolves, bears, dogs, etc. Um, yeah. I've read all of this. I've been reading all the, the, the lore and stuff as Amelia reads a book. I have been reading books. In the old-fashioned way. Uh-huh. Um, um, so you're going to take this beastie head to this man in order to get more information to determine the best approach about how to find Yennefer, our love. Mm-hmm. And Met, thank you for the sub. And Gamer Bros, thanks for using your Prime. Appreciate you being here. Gamer Bros 90s is awesome. And Avatar, thank you Avatar78 for the sub as well. Welcome to the crew, you guys. Ooh, oh. make way. Right, here we go, advance. Hey, Ink Cat Lady, it's your first time here. Welcome. Come on in. What the hell is this? Roy! You take me for a blind man or a fool? This grain is rotten. No, I, I didn't know. So, a fool. Damn it, you never learn. Military Codex, Article 2, Section 3. For the delivery of defective goods, 15 lashes with a knout. Make it so. No, no, no! By the gods, no! <sighs> The Nilfgaardian occupation is really beating down the peasants around here. What? Well, I killed the Griffin, but um, what happened to Captain Nice Guy? Guess you've dropped your good uncle act. It was no act. I extended a hand to these people. They spat on it. Could it be because it held the sword that killed their loved ones? Tcha! <laughs> a moralist. And what would you do in my stead? Wouldn't ever be in your stead. Tell yeah. me why you've come. Honestly, I killed the Griffin. 
just like you wanted. Fulfilled my end of the bargain. Your turn. Where'd Yennefer go? To Vizima. She was a day's ride from here the whole time? Under my nose? Might have said so. Yes, I might have. But you would not have killed the griffin. Tit for tat. Halt! We are not done. It's yours, this gold. I would not want you to say you were inadequately compensated. Dialogue, time constrained options. Some dialogues demand that you make a quick decision. Choose your reply before the time runs out. <sighs> we want coin from this clown? We do actually need some upgrades. Yeah. Yeah, I'll take it. I'll take the coin. Okay. Yeah, okay, I want it. Because I needed the money. What's your excuse? Jokes on you. Oh man, these Nilf Guardians are. Yo! Yeah! It makes that sound when we complete quests, and that's enough for me. Alright, we're gonna prepare to leave White Orchard. So, for those of you who are unfamiliar, the beautiful lands, uh, as they once were, have now been overtaken uh, by. Here, we'll look at the world map. Uh, the Nilf Guardians have mm. occupied, they set up this garrison. Uh, they are going around demanding uh, payments, of course, from all of the, uh, the peasants, and uh, they're exacting their rule, and we're going to get to explore further out in the world now, I believe. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, so you're gonna go and try and find Yennefer, yeah? Yeah, that, that's yeah. what we want. That's our, that's our main mission right now, is to catch up with Yennefer. Let's see, we can talk. Oh, collect them blow ball like we do. And Amy versus. Hey, Amy, thank you so much thank for you. the gifts of group hug. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thanks, Amy. All right, I want to talk to this quartermaster and see if we can make some upgrades. Okay. Password. He's all about. Don't know any. So, out for a little walk here, eh? Counting the Emperor's swords to lull you to sleep? Well, in the army, we have a place for nosy ramblers the scaffold. And thick skulled quartermasters, they got a place. <laughs> uh, you're clearly skilled at banter. And haggling? You got a knack for that as well? Mm, yeah, I do, actually. Mm -hmm. uh, and did you know sometimes you can be like, nah, that's not enough coin, though. I need, I need some more coin. And then uh, you, can, you, can, you can negotiate up. Um, you gonna craft something for me? Let me see what you got. Show me what you're peddling. What you peddling, man? What you peddling? All right, let's see if there's any of these swords that are better than- Whoa! That's a significantly better sword. Can we even afford it? We have 53 coin. Oh, some good prices around here. So, 51 damage is up from where we're at. I think that's what we like to see. That's a steel sword. All of these are steel swords, I think. So those are for fighting humans, for yeah? For humans and animals, and then the, the, the monsters get- It's not worth it. It's not worth it. Get the patterns, get the upgrades, and we can do it on our own. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, crafting diagram, slashing damage up. Craft your own swords. The green text is the improvement. Yes, that is correct. Raging Girl, thank you for the cheers with Mooba. Appreciate you. And Idle Tina, welcome back for five months. <laughs> All right. Slashing damage, 38 up. Okay, I'm going to go for this one. Can I use that? That's a master item. Save my coins for later. We'll find better gear during quests. All right, we'll leave this guy alone then. Goodbye, man. But I want to sh I want to double check that I've got everything repaired up because I don't want my my weapons to be too weak. And we're at 52%. All right. Fine printing. Craft them up. See you later, man. So long. Farewell. I like these little glasses. Yes, our items have been enhanced. I don't really want to talk to any of these soldiers. They give me bad vibes. Mm. Let's go. Ah. Ah. This sucks. Yep. Do you like this outfit? I look like a circus tent, don't I? So, uh, 
uh, we're preparing to leave White Orchard. And for those of you who are asking about who is Yennefer, who is Yennefer indeed? Yennefer is... This uh, is Yennefer. Yes. She is the raven-haired sorceress that we met a good 20 years back. And our friendship and feelings between us have grown. But, uh, you know... You, you love Yennefer? I had a feeling that might be the case. Uh, she has also been called the woman of uh, the, the woman of war because she wherever she goes, war quickly follows right after her. You know who follows right after me? Who? Roach. The horse. My fine steed for extreme travel. Onward. Mush, of course. Whoa there, Roach. Ooh, something to slay. Who it is? A wolf? Hey, wolf. Let's win some that XP. Give me some of that dog taro. Tallow, whatever that is. Anybody know what dog tallow is? Oh, vengeance, you think, hey? Uh, and also, uh, a worthy update, we've switched over to story and sword because story mode was just too chill for me. All right, Tallow is fat. is fat, yes. So you can, like, make marshmallows. <laughs> or soap. Yeah, maybe so, but I don't think the Witcher makes a lot of marshmallows. I don't know, he does spend a lot of time on the road. S'more could be good. S'more could be good. Get out of my way, you bad. Bad invading army. So yeah, we've completely, uh... Dog marshmallows? Ew. Um, yeah, we've completely gone through all of the areas in... The white Orchard, so oh, all the little side quests, That's it, places Roach. of power. Alright. Too dangerous. On horseback, I need yeah, to they're ride. all very intimidated by you. Makes sense. And Bernier's snoring. He bumped his head when he went to bed and wet himself in the morning. You shouldn't read you shouldn't sing that about the Emperor. He will not will not be pleased. What do you say? Who told you that? Not be pleased. You guys want to play a hand of Gwent? Because I do. <laughs> I'm running out of people who play. I played Gwent with the same scholar a million times over. But, oh, he's gone. Oh, here, our dude. What's up, my dude? Vesemir. Vesemir, what's going on then? Yennefer's in Vizima. Got a few friends there, so. Something wrong? Look around. Trouble brewing. Real quick. For those of you who are like, I want to see the side quest too. This game is gigantic and you will see side quests. Um, who are they? Who are they? Patriots drinking their seventh round for Tamaria. Fists starting to itch. Don't see any enough guardians. They'll find another foe. I'll buy some provisions for the journey. Then we'll go. Geralt, we should stay out of it. Just this once. But I'm so powerful. What happened to the lilies? Took them down. Took them down? To hang a golden sun there now? <sighs> the golden sun is the invading I cannot army. show Tamerian colors. They'll come and burn the tavern down. Maybe it's true what they say. You fund of the Imperials, you Nilfgaard's whore! I'll let that pass. I know grief eats at your heart. You know shit! They hang my sister, dragged her out the cloister like a dog. Said Nilfgaard's no place for superstition. That they don't fear the wrath of the gods. And you, do you fear it? If not for Annie, your child would have choked on its navel string. You owe your son to Let my sister attending to the no. birth, and you don't oh. fear the gods' wrath. You don't oh. fear it, you cunt! Oh. <gasps> Leave me be! Damn. 
recognize this medallion? You know what it means. Back off. You all right? They say witches steal young'uns. That's true. What'd the Emperor promise you, freaks? Your own land? Like he did the elves once? Get out, all of you. We ain't going nowhere. Oh, you don't want to do neither this. are you. They won't no. back down now. I can see that. Mm, you're gonna get square, square, triangle, square, square, dodge. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, dead. Done. That was fast. I need oh. Fatality! It's all right. It's over. Leave me be! Get away! You started this shit, actually. See his face! God save us! Be gone. And don't ever come back. <laughs> She's like, I had six patrons! I have now one patron! So for not getting involved. Come on, let's go. You did send his head across the room. You know, so. Mm hmm. Had to. These guys are heavily armed. Right? We didn't start it. Oh! Who it is? Excuses, excuses. You've not changed a bit. Y Yen? How? I received a report about a witcher who'd appeared in White Orchard. I knew it was you, looking for me. I might have waited until you found me, but... Oh, you know me. Patience has never been my strong suit. It's... Good to see you, Geralt. You kind of look like her. I... I'd even <laughs> embrace you. Were you not covered in blood? Sorry. Wasn't expecting to see you. To be honest, this isn't at all how I imagined we'd meet. How did you imagine it? You didn't imagine you'd have a Nilfgaardian escort. Don't get me wrong, Yennefer. I'm glad to see you. But I do think you owe us an explanation. And I shall provide it. In Vizima. Ready your horses. Did you say Emphysema? Mmm, <laughs> why the rush? Spent the last six months in the saddle. I haven't seen you for two years. Can't we take a moment to... Sadly, we cannot. Someone awaits you, Geralt. Someone who doesn't like to be kept waiting. Emperor Emir Var Emrys. Or, to those on more intimate terms with him, the white flame dancing on the graves of his foes. Doubt I number among that group. For as I remember, last time we saw each other, he wanted to kill me. Well, now he wishes to make you an offer. The kind one can't refuse? I didn't. Though I could have. Well... I wonder what he offered you. Must have been a damn good offer then. Not many things you'd give up your freedom for. And even fewer people. The sooner we set off, the sooner you'll find out. What about you? I'm going in the opposite direction. No. I somehow doubt the Emperor's invitation mentioned me. Besides, I've got things to do at Kaer Morhen, remember? Yeah, I remember. Thanks for your help, Vesemir. See you soon. Love you, bro. Love you too. How's your horse? You Swift? Can't complain. Why do you ask? I'd like to be back behind some thick city walls as soon as possible. I like in gooseberries. Nice. Just collecting that XP, you know? I do like their little their little wings on their helmets. Yeah, but wings on helmets is not like a reason to like go with an entire kind of no, imperial. I'm just, yeah, I in, in general of their outfits I, I like that part. <laughs> yeah, they got super cool armor. No doubt. You know, I had a dream about you recently. Knowing you, it was probably filthy. <laughs> Just the beginning. But then, 
But then... Super powerful. Yeah. Yeah, it's our first playthrough. Yeah, yeah, the blinds, everything is coming our way, so please tomorrow, no spoilers. All right? After the audience. Woo! Woo! Yo. That's what I like to see. This bard's tale begins near White Orchard, with my dear friend Geralt of Rivia seeking his lover of yore, the sorceress Yennefer. She'd eluded him for years, but now seemed just a few Two steps ahead. Steps. After many trials and tribulations, Geralt finally learned that Yen was in nearby Vizima. Yeah, nearby Vizima. The capital of occupied Temeria. One day later, in that fresh scrub. I mean, that is a way to get a bath. I've never had a bath with... I feel like that'd be really ticklish. Three ma... <laughs> <laughs> hey, stop it, you guys. Like a king. That's right. Mm. It must suffice. Think of your cares if I'm clean. The gentleman will refer to his imperial stars. majesty by his full title or not at all. The gentleman will be seated on the berger. The what now? In that chair. Catwin, please shave the gentleman's sideburns to half an inch. I don't think the gentleman wants to be shaved to half an inch like this. He seems okay with it. No. <laughs> What's wrong with my beard? Always thought it added to my dignity. It does. Yet it also detracts from your elegance. In Nilfgaard, we consider beards hard on the eyes. Oh. Especially beards infested with lice. Been on the road a while. Fine, do your thing. Tilt your head back, please, and sit still. I don't like it. <laughs> and prepare to answer some questions. General, I, I am not certain this is the appropriate time. I can't think of a better time. Men turn honest when they feel a blade at their throat. Movran Vuris, commander of the Alba Division. Before they take you in to see the Emperor, Witcher, there's some information I need you to verify. It's a formality. All right, it's I didn't one play that Witcher must be two. seen to. Sure, paperwork's got to be in order. So, Geralt of Rivia, place of birth unknown, parents unknown, age unknown. Yep. All insignificant details. Let us proceed to more recent events. The siege of La Valette Castle. The fate of the defending commander, one Arian. Well... Did I spare his life and he escaped, or I killed him during the siege? Just happened that way. Mm. I don't know. What did you do, Bri? Uh, you don't remember? I spared his life. Yeah, yeah. We fought on opposing sides, true. Then we landed in the same dungeon. Arian escaped, set fire to the castle on his way out. So that is how the blade started. Our reports suggested the dragon was responsible. Moving on. You then found shelter in charming Flotsam, 
and from there made your way to Virgo. My question is how? How did I make it there? Well, I was helped I don't know enough about this, but uh, I got out of Flotsam with Vernon Roach. I got out of Flotsam with Vernon Roach, commander of the Blue Stripes and... A murderer of non-humans. We know this gentleman well, Witcher. You forge interesting alliances. Something tells me my most interesting is yet to come. Go on, next question, before my beard grows back in. We shall shave you again if it does. Don't stop shaving me! The infamous summit at Loch Muin. Ah. You were there. I was. And once again meddled in the affairs of the mighty. Yep. I mean, I had to save Triss. And I also was helping Roche rescue Aeneas. But, uh, I had to save Trish. Triss. What Who's do you guys Triss? think? Who's Triss? I don't know yet, really. Oh, okay, okay. Triss, Triss, Triss. Triss, Triss. Yes. <laughs> we want to save Triss, right? That's why we did it? Would you agree? Overall, I see a lot for Triss. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I had to. The I mighty had to. imprisoned Triss Marigold. I don't know I care about her. And I tend to rescue those I care about. And so you did, handing Radovid control of the Conclave and Council of Mages in the process. Nilfgaard yes. recently started a war, unprovoked. So do us both a favor and stop moralizing. The gentleman must sit still. I'm almost done. I'm afraid I might find that difficult. Because, from what I know, shortly afterwards you watched a defective megascope blow your friend Sheila de Tansaville to bits. I did. I did do that. But Sile escaped or got what was coming to her. Help me out here, friends, because I know we got a lot of pros in this game. Escape. They escaped. Escape. You think? She escape? They escape? Escape. Mm-hmm. Probably escaped. Overall, I'm seeing a lot of escape. I watched her get in the megascope, but ultimately freed her from the trap your man Letho of Gullet had set. Write that down. Write that down. I want to be sure the paperwork's in order now. Well, national interest calls on one to forge difficult alliances at times. Alliances with witches included. You hitting on me? <laughs> alliance is dead. See, I killed Letho, or that alliance is still alive. What happened to Letho? Is Letho alive? Alive. Letho's alive after all this time? Mara, I thought so. I, that's what I felt. Had an ongoing alliance. What's Letho up to? I had hoped you would answer that question. Ah, so Letho's hiding from you. Must have a good reason. Mm -hmm. Was there a shift in national interest that might have caused that? I don't know where he is. Wouldn't tell you if I did anyway. Blade or no blade to my throat. I believe that is all. Your signature, please, affirming you stated the whole truth and nothing but the truth on pain of imprisonment or death, etc., etc. Here and here. With these formalities seen to, I would ask the general to leave the room. We shall be choosing the gentleman's attire. An important matter, but one that does not require the general's assistance. Shale. I might have given you some advice. So long, Geralt. Good luck with your audience. I'm gonna regrow that beard as fast as I can. <laughs> I'm never shaving it again. Feels more like I'm being readied for a wedding. Were that so? I would have prepared the gentleman a frock, a tailcoat, or possibly a dinner jacket. In point of fact, the gentleman will choose from these garments. Where are my clothes? I, got, I, I, I sold a lot of wolf liver so that I could save up and buy myself some new armor. Where are mine? I want my clothes. Where are my clothes? Where they should have gone long ago, with the laundress. They will be returned to you after the audience, clean and starched. The gentleman will tell me once he has chosen an outfit. Why do you keep referring to me as the gentleman? He's trying to uh, influence you with his words. All right, let's check out these outfits here. I'll loot this, I'll loot that, I'll loot this. 
Which one do you like, guys? Well, I think the either one on the ends, the one in the middle, I feel like that ruffle is not quite your style. Yeah, this insults everything about, I do not want to look like a bag of yams, all tied up, cinched at the top. Yeah. And these are pretty similar to each other. This one's a little more swirly. Um, this one's a little less swirly. Maybe a little less swirly. A little less swirly, but I kind of loot them all. Oh, common doublet is all you offer me? I take all of your shit. <laughs> you took my beard, I take your clothes. This might come as news to the gentleman, but a towel wrapped around one's waist is not fitting attire for an audience. The gentleman Are you kidding me? will kindly dress. I look fucking awesome right now. If I looked like this guy, I would walk around in a towel all the time. <laughs> <sighs> All right, guys, we need pants for the the gentleman needs pants. The gentleman needs pants. Um, also, Amidala, thank you so much for the gift oh, sub group hug. Thank and you, Amidala. Cosmic Georgie, thank you as well for the gift sub. Appreciate oh, you. Man, it would be so cool if we just go around slashing monsters wearing a towel. Um, All right, Amelia, let's yeah. look at them. What do we got? That this one? That fine, yeah. All the pants look the same. This one. No. Oh. Uh, yeah, we were right the first time. Yeah. This mm -hmm, one. Mm -hmm. This one. If we gotta do it, we gotta do it. But it does not have much armor at all. That's not the point. You just have to look good. Yeah, but I'm a witcher. I might need to decapitate someone at a moment's notice. Elegant shoes? Nilfgaardian shoes? Or... Nilfgaardian shoes? <laughs> or Nilfgaardian shoes. I think we'll go with the Nilfgaardian shoes. Mm, yeah. And they're all the same pants, so we'll sell them if we can. Oh, man, this is... Don't tell anyone. I kind of like the ruffles over your knees. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Come on. And Let's they go. say clothes do not make the man. They don't. Does the outfit satisfy the gentleman? Mm. Yeah. Yeah, fine. A studded doublet and a sword on my back. That's what would satisfy me. Yeah. But tough. When in Nilfgaard. Yes. It's a saying. So what now? Powder my nose? <laughs> no need. The gentleman's complexion is light enough. The gentleman is to stand before the ruler of the north and south. I must confirm that he knows how to bow. I'm not some boar. I know how to bow. Please, demonstrate. That, sir, is how you might bow to a whore on a street corner, not to the Emperor of Nilfgaard. Please watch. Leg extended, hand flat, head down, chin to chest. No, nope. I'm gonna give him a nod. Reverse. I'm gonna give him like, what's up? This is absurd. Gotta be kidding. Not at all. I am mortally serious. Does the gentleman know the penalty for breaches of etiquette in the Emperor's presence? 200 lashes. I do not wish that upon him. I so I will not let him leave until lashes. I am confident that he knows how to behave. Okay, fine. Uh, uh, right leg forward. Left hand on chest. Ta-da! Wrong, wrong, damn, wrong. Damn, 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 damn. Once more. Leg extended, hand, hand flat, flat, head, head down, down, chin to chin chest. To chest. Uh. The gentleman will rehearse. Listen, I can start fire by going like this, and you need me. Okay. Leg yeah, back, yeah, hand on side. chest, yeah. Left leg forward, right hand on chest. A la la la. Mm, lacking fluidity and grace. It's my first but time. But we've learned to expect less of Nordlings. Come with me. All right. All right. The gentleman will address the emperor only when asked to, and using the appropriate type. Your arch magnificency. I see the gentleman <laughs> is in the mood for jests. I fear the emperor might not share his disposition. Your majesty will suffice. Spoken loudly, clearly, and with respect. Fine. Nervous for you. I'm listening, guys. Oh, none of you are the king there. Oh. Uh, Imgrimi at Art Kerzer. 
Dyfen Aden in Karn Eb Marvut, Emir Var Emreis. Bow. Do it! Do it! Do it! Do it! Do it! Fine. But not happily. <laughs> your so what happens when you play video games with your wife nagging I, over your shoulder? Uh, bow, 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 bow to the emperor of the north and south. <laughs> I didn't want to watch you get 50 lashes, Brian. <laughs> Alright, now I'm going to stand up extra straight. I thought you bowed before no man. Listen, man, I'm just dealing with you. Didn't want to disappoint the Chamberlain. We're friends. Take it you didn't summon me to reminisce about the good old days, so... Silence. My daughter, Cyrilla, she's returned. And she's in danger. The wild hunt pursues her. You will find her and bring her to me. I hate to tell you this, but your daughter's not a looker. <laughs> she looks very angry in that portrait. Are you sure? Siri left. Went far, far away. Do you believe I drag you here in the middle of a war to discuss a rumor? I think anyone can be wrong, even an emperor. I had forgotten how insolent you can be. I haven't. I take my to bow back. My wife made me do it. I didn't want to do it. Yennefer will do that after the audience. How many men in your army? Twenty thousand? Thirty? So why me? You know why. Because she trusts you. She trusts me, yes. So tell me why you're looking for her. Doubt it's about making up for all those lost years. For reasons of state, as always. Enough of this banter. You will agree regardless. If for no other reason than because I shall pay you. More than you customarily receive for a contract. Considerably more. Maybe she just hates the dress. I think yeah. you're right. I think she's pouty because she's being put up in the... She looks like a, like a cupcake. Is Siri the, the, the yeah. little one from the beginning? Yeah, yeah. Who was doing flips blindfolded? Yeah. That's very different than this depiction here. Yes. I need information to determine the best approach. I need information, not motivation. Siri leaves few tracks. She'll be hard to find. My core of spies will help you. Count on them, and my army, should the need arise. Yennefer will tell you the rest. This audience is finished. To me by fate. Meredith! Take him to the sorceress. So that's Charles Dance, the voice actor who plays Tywin Lannister. Follow me, if the gentleman pleases. Please keep close. There are many honorable guests in the palace whom the gentleman disgusts. Need not bother. I have this. Can I loot this shit? I want that. Don't need the wings, but other than that, I'm taking that armor. Alaskan Jackson, welcome back for 18 months. And Plinkety, thanks for cheering. And it's past noon. Calm yourself. What? What? Do you know who you're talking to, soldier? I'm Herevard the second, Prince of Elanda. Not only am I making Look wait here like cathedral. a supplicant. Hello. You guys want to play Gwent? A tinter. Tanner. I'll say that. Master of the Tanner. The scene is fun. Yeah. It's a damn difference. I demand. Rad Sleeton e enekt es tun es saur an nein fire. Es is seed efsa. Ef finza nein mach es rum. Nein kofurtel an ent avar. Es gleidelen. Yes. This is a really cool. Just, I'll, I'll be right back with you. I know, I know you want to look at this place. Wow. I like the stained glass. Right? This is just so cool. I think one of my absolute favorite things about um, open world games is just like not doing what they want me to do. Like, wait, is your hair purple? Is your hair purple? No. Yes. No. Excuse me, my wife would like to know. Yes. Oh, it's a hood. No, it's a hood. My wife would like to know where you got your hat. <laughs> it looks good on One you, darling. You look great. You will regret it. 
building this. What's incredible is think about the tools that they use to build this. You know, like. I saw you in Brazil. And how many people I must have taken? All right, back to the back to the dog. Can I collect any of these things? I am a collector. I would like to have the oh myrtle, white myrtle petals are my favorite. Those are you can sell those for one coin each. Mm, I need that. Excuse me. Mm, Witcher sends any extra loot. You guys are really, you need to up your security because people can just take your white myrtle petals, no problem. Once the gentleman is done, he should see me to retrieve his possessions. All right, I'm going to talk to Yennefer. You hang out here. Uh, I just like to explore. We'll sharpen yet. Yes? Then transcribe. The true authority in Novigrad is not the city council or the merchant's guild. Oh, what is this? Of the eternal fire and the criminal Whoa, under. this is the a coolest difficult to tell them workshop one. ever. They both display a similar <gasps> What's A bucket tank! Here's your way to your excellency. Falling behind. You know what? I'll write the report myself. You'll need only prepare a clean draft. In triplicate. All right, Yennefer. Geralt, that tunic. You look positively smashing. Ugh, dying to take it off. I'd consider that a proposition under different circumstances. One I might even take you up on. But we've matters to attend to. Now do you understand why I'm at Emir's court? Mm-hmm. And seems we're in the same boat now. Siri, she's really back? No chance he's mistaken? Look, that's more or less what she looks like now. Or so our agents claim. Our little witch has grown into a young lady. Far less ugly than the painting. <laughs> mm. yeah, well, so there are agents now? <laughs> so there are our agents now? My, my. You've clearly settled in quick. Geralt, don't twist my words. I know who Emir is. He started this war and its bloodshed. He had my friends killed. But I haven't any other choice, so please... Let's not belabor the pros and cons, and instead, focus on finding Ciri. All right? Right. Amir said the wild hunts after her. I'd find that hard to believe, before what happened yesterday. How did they track us down? Because of me. You see, I've spent months searching for Ciri. Using locating spells, haruspicy, geomancy, anything, really. I knew the wild hunt might sense it. Perhaps even find me, but I thought I'd trick them. Well, guess you were wrong. Hmm. I've sensed them on my trail, hunting me for some time. If not for you and Amir's soldiers, they'd have gotten what they were after. I can't risk another encounter like that. It's time to put away the magic, turn to more traditional methods. To the best tracker I know. You must find her, Geralt, before the Wild Hunt does. What's the Wild Hunt want? The Wild Hunt? What could it want from Ciri? I've no clue, Geralt. Might have written them to ask, but I don't have their address. I know as much as you do. It must be about her blood. Her gift. As for what the Hunt wishes to do with that gift, I... I prefer not to think about it, really. All right. So where has Ciri been seen, exactly? In two places. Velen and Novigrad. The trail in Velen is most promising. You should make that your first stop. Will Ask do. for a merchant named Hendrik at the inn at the crossroads. One of the Emperor's agents. That? He should get in touch with you. That's it? No passwords? Secret handshakes? None. Sorry to spoil your fun. Your boyhood fantasies about the crafts of the trade. All we have in Novigrad are unconformed reports, rumors. But there you will have the help of our mutual acquaintance. 
Beatrice Merigold. Apparently she's got a cozy flat on the main square. Sure she'll be delighted to see me. What about you? What will you do? I shall sail for Skellige. There was a magic explosion there recently, blew half a forest down. I believe this had something to do with Ciri. I'll be in care trolled. Join me there once you've learned something. All right. But, uh, I kind of missed you, and you, you, you wrote me this letter about the unicorn, and... <laughs> One thing before we go. Why didn't you contact me? Didn't need me? Didn't even want to see me? I didn't want to spoil things. I'd heard you and Triss made a great couple. Yen, I'd lost my memory. Really? That's your excuse? I mean, if you don't have a memory, it's really hard to... Let's drop it, all right? It's not what you think, or it helped me understand how much I love you. I don't wish to hear it. Any of it. All right, let's go. I gotta get out of these tights. Guess this means we need to split up again. Not my preference, but I understand. Clock's ticking. It is indeed. So why don't I teleport you to Velen, get you there at once? Not gonna happen. I'll go on horseback, as soon as I can get changed. Have it your way? Oh, and you really look quite dashing in black velvet. Think so? Maybe I can have some of my armor lined with it. <laughs> Good luck, Yen. Same to you. And if you wish to learn what's happened in the world while you and Vesemir roam the wilderness, Talk to Ambassador Vartra. That's him over there. And Geralt, I know it's wartime, but try not to be a hero, all right? Just check those leads and come back to me in one piece. I shall be waiting. Nice. All right, all right. She likes the clean-shaven look. She 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 like my crush for my velvet. <laughs> wow. All right, we've got a new main mission here, my friends. Mm -hmm. Ooh -wee. Yes. It's time for a hydration break. I appreciate you all being here. Whoosh, into the portal she goes and away. Well, I'm gonna do a manual save. We're gonna take a hydration break like we do each hour. And uh, onward we go, eh? Hey. Thank you all for being here and for retweeting to invite your friends. I see Absurdist Ninja with the gifts up to Jazzy. And Rice Phoebes, thank you for the gifts up as well. Appreciate you being back for or the resub, welcome back for two months. Shadow Jackson, thank you for the cheers. I see Osiris is back for 10 months. Uh, Jess Wise is back for seven. Irasaka, thank you for being here for a whole year in a row. Nice. One and whole year. Hawk and Wolf, thank you for the gift sub to Rubix. Appreciate you all. We're gonna be back in five minutes. Uh, get some hydration, get a snack. Move, move around. around. <laughs> uh, you know, we'll see you guys very, very soon. Thanks for joining us.
Click. Click. Welcome back, everybody. Oh, welcome back, friends. So I got a hot tip that there's a guy in this garden who plays Gwent, which means that I can challenge him. He is a Nilfgaardian nobleman, and he wants to play Gwent with us. So nice. So we're, we're going to go. High as, five. Hey, <laughs> as you can see, I uh, started even running there during the hydration break, but got caught by this guy who took my clothes. So I got to get my clothes back, oh, okay. and then I can play some Gwent. All right. Uh, Dana Louise, welcome back for nine, ten months. Thank you for being here. Super appreciate you. And Lord Hayabusa, thank you for this gift sub hey, group hug. Hey, thank you so much. Hey, much appreciate the love, thank my friend. You, friend. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I see also that we got a gift sub group hug right as we went to our hydration break from Jedula. Ooh, Jedula. Jedula. Thank you as well. We hug to you as thank well. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We, we bow to you mm -hmm. as the witcher. Yes. As the Witcher would not like to. We have to do a little. We dab to the east. We dab to the west. Uh -huh. We do a little of this. We do a little luau for you. <laughs> um, we appreciate you all. And if you got one of those gift subs from these generous folk, please check out the starter kit. The starter kit will show you around how you can take advantage of our subscriber chats, Roach, Garden, and Yeniko there we go. <laughs> uh, today. And uh, we've also got um, 10 times entry for our prize giveaway for anybody who gives a gift sub one or many. So yeah. we really appreciate you guys. And to say thank you uh, for joining us on the stream, we sign these pins and postcards and send them to you around about the world. Also, Hufflepuff, thanks for being here for 16 months. Demented hey. Furby is cheering. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I see Mooney, thank you for the gift sub as well, Mooney. And the Splendid Dame in a Blender. Splenda in a Blender. Splenda in a Blender. Mm -hmm. Damn, it's been a long time in this quarantine life. This man's just going crazy. Uh, thief, Thief in Darkness. Yeah. Yes. Thief in Darkness. Good username. Thank you for using your Prime. If you guys have Amazon Prime, you can link it to Twitch with the button that looks like that down below the video. Let's take a second to say thank you to our mods. Mm -hmm. Thank you to our lieutenants. Yeah. And thank you guys for not spoiling anything because this is our first playthrough. Ever. Ever. We, we've never witched any witcher. We never have. Mm -mm. I never would. Hawk and Wolf, welcome back for 11 months. You two are my absolute two favorite streamers to watch. Really? How lucky for you that we're <laughs> con condensed into one small package. Just the two of us. If you ever want to see us streaming, we're streaming together all the Pint time. Pint-sized. 
Uh, um, and Shark Bite J, thank you for the gift sub to Ketrin End. And Moad DLC with the gift sub to Phoenix X Goth. An inked cat lady. I believe you. Mm-hmm. I bet you got some sweet ink too. Please tell me you got a cat tattoo. <laughs> oh, and Gina, thank you. Gina. Gina, Gina. Thank you, Gina. <laughs> thank you very much, everybody. Um, we're going to jump back into the game, I think. But to let you know, this is our. Saturday game, The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt, and on Sundays... Tomorrow. Whether you like it or not... Little nightmares, too. Creepy, creepy, creepy. <laughs> yeah, so we're doing that tomorrow. And then on Wednesday, we are going to begin Concrete Genie. Yeah, Concrete Genie is going to help balance out the... Uh, Spookiness. Hopefully the EP creepy of Little Monsters, Nightmare. Monsters, yeah. We can, we can balance it out with some Concrete Genie. Mm-hmm. And Green Kofia, thank you for being here and subscribing, as well as Foxy Roxy, who is back for 33, 33 months. months. Get hyped for 33 months, and Black Cat plays for 34 months. Wow. These folks have been here with us since the very beginning of our streaming adventure. It's almost been three years streaming on Twitch, my friends. Wow. <laughs> I'm going to jump into my little box and I'm going to do it like this. Oh, damn. Damn. Now you guys know how the magic trick works. Wait, let's try it again. Ready? Let's jump into our box. We're going to jump into our box like this. Hey! <laughs> there you go. See? Smooth. See? Smooth. It's, it's real magic. It's actual magic. I um, appreciate you guys all being here. Quacks, one, two, three. What? Thank you for being here for a whole year of support, bud. Appreciate you very much. And Blue Crusher, Charlie the Astronaut, thank you for all the cheers. It's okay for me. Thank you for the gift sub. I want to jump into the game. Plinkety, thank you for the big cheers. All right, we're ready for it. Let's do it. <clears throat> Let's do it. We just we just started walking out the door, and then this guy was chatting us up. Give me my clothes. Citrus and cloves. The fragrance will keep the gentleman's robes fresh somewhat longer. <sighs> Thank you. Thanks, Bunches. <laughs> the Emperor is not known for his patience. He wants his daughter back safe and sound. As soon as possible. Yeah. Okay. Mention something of the sort. Okay. So long. I'm out of here. <laughs> Imperial audience. And yo! Yo! That's, that's the sound you get when you complete a quest, and I love to hear it. Yo! <laughs> Frank the Hank! Frank the Hank, thank you for the hey, gift so Thank you so much, Frank the Hank. Frank the Hank, leading the way. Leading the way. All right. I Man, that would be really cool if in real life, when you completed something, all of a sudden from the heavens, yeah. Yeah, can you guys imagine, like, you, you finally finish folding all of your obnoxious laundry and the world is like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Who around here wants to play? Are you a nobleman? No, you're a courier. Some basic courier. Courier, courier. Noble woman, but not noble men. Noble men. Hey, dude. Mm. Mm. You Gwent? Yo, bro, do you even Gwent? I Gwent. Betting. Ooh, to place a bet. Choose an amount and then confirm by pressing X. You will win twice as much as you lose, probably. All right, should we bet five? Yeah, do it. All right, we're going to... We're gonna, we're gonna take Wouldn't this mind a five. few rounds of cards. Prediction. Should we do a prediction? You can do a prediction. Yeah, right. you do a prediction while I set up my deck. I'm gonna show you guys what I. This card, this poor fucking infantry card, made me laugh so hard when I discovered it. Just do short question mark, win or lose. Um, and uh, I've added a couple of cards to our deck but not many i i can't remove any because i have the minimum number of unit cards um and i don't have much else but i'm gonna leave the rest i think all right so there is a prediction up at the top of the stream chat if you want to uh bet your channel points which you get just by being here on the channel and typing in they have no monetary value other than being able to use them on our channel for things like this so if you think brian is gonna win i'm gonna win or lose i'm gonna wreck this clown bet your channel points now bet those points shake shalawala bet those points i love to see it all right i'm gonna start this game up okay I will go first will go against first. the Nilfgaardian Empire. I can choose to redraw two of these cards. 
Um, impenetrable Fog and Impenetrable Fog I can summon using my leader ability, so I'm just gonna toss both of those back in. This is my standard move. Couple more seconds to vote. I see 76% of you believe in me. 77. 77, thank you to that one person. Okay, let us begin. Aha. Uh -huh. I like to start by drawing my enemies onto the battlefield with my weaker opponents, such as young Yarpin. Yarpin is a handsome fellow, but not much for fighting. My opponent will now meet me on the battlefield. Ooh, blade on blade. More blades, you say. Let us, now that we've got him in where we want him, send along a brother in arms. Zoltan. This, remember Zoltan. Opponent's turn. So we're trying to keep our score higher than their score, and once we are succeeded to such a degree that we would pass, oh uh, yeah, I'm gonna spread this out a little bit. So we keep, uh, I really like this chick. I'm all about Kira Metz. Kira Metz is probably my favorite card. The art, anyway. Commander's Horn, what does that do? Oh shit, oh, that no. inspires them. That oh, inspires no. them. They've been inspired. Don't let them be inspired. <sighs> Let's see. It was a decoy after all. Do I use the decoy? Is that too much? The, so the decoy, which is fun about this card, I can swap out one on the deck. So I'm going to, I'm going to call this. It wasn't Zoltan. You all thought it was Zoltan, but it was not. It was a decoy after all. <laughs> Opponent's turn. Your opponent has passed, but my opponent is a fool because I have frost here. I will use this frost to wreck his mood. <laughs> now, anybody who is using a sword in those two rounds mm. is reduced down. And I am ahead, and I will pass. And I say, come at me, bro. Nice, Do you, even, do you even Gwent? Look at you, Gwent. I love card games. All right, so the Northern Realms, get everybody draws a card. Um... Same kind of deal. Uh, let's. We don't have a ton in the archery range round. This is a cl this. This one will clear up the sky, which I love. This clear day card. So if anybody plays a weather card, you oh. can like wipe the nice, wipe nice. the weather card. So we hang on to that one. Okay. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go full trebuchet style because do your thing. This guy's gonna he's gonna try to put some rain on me, and I'm gonna clear him up. That's not even a trebuchet. That's a ballista. Hmm. Mm -mm. Well, that's a powerful card. Mm, very powerful. But not too powerful for a guy like me. Check this out. More tribuchet! We're gonna crush him. We're gonna crush him. Ooh, hey Cynthia. What's going on with you? Okay, he's ahead still, but watch this. Now this dude is plus one to all units in the same row. So these which were previously six become seven. Ooh. We got this. Commander's horn again. Mm -hmm. I don't. I don't have a commander's horn. I need a card like that. Oh damn! Commander's horn's a good, good card. All right. Well, something I know is that if they have a bunch of their power in the archery range, they probably won't play weather against it. So I'm going to stay in the same vicinity. If I pass, I'll lose. You want me to pass the whole round? Oh, no. I'm a fool. I'll just keep keep going. I think I can win. <laughs> can I win? Uh-oh. Maybe not. Alright. Mm, mm, not looking good. Poker says it's not looking so good. I may summon the fog. I may have to summon the fog. Leader card? All right. I always forget that I have the leader card, so the leader card, his ability allows me to go through my deck and pull out the fog card and play that. Okay. So then I drop him down. Yup, yup, yup. Letho. Don't even come at me, bro. Your turn? Okay. You want me to pass right now? But then can't he play the rest of his cards out? You win if he doesn't clear the sky, but if he clears the sky, I'm in trouble, but... This is only gonna be one one up. I'm gonna pass. No, is that too much? Do, do what we feel. Do what you feel. All right, 
I'm gonna pass because then if it comes to a third round, I still have a, a five, a five guy left. Oh, look at that! Oh, look at that! Your opponent won the round. Okay, let's hope that in the final throws of it. Wow, this guy has some tough cards. Yeah. All right, he's got an archer. What is that shit? What is that? Oh, uh, should have cleared the frost before calling the fog. That would have been a good call. Yeah, no, this is over. Burn too many cards. Too many cards. Well. Wait, does that mean you're going to lose all your cards that you collected? No, we're going to lose our five coins. Here, let's just clear the day. Damn, that was going pretty well for a second. Your opponent has won the round and therefore the game. Uh, Defeat it. You lose. Prediction. Let's play again. I need one more. I can't I can't walk away from this man having lost. Let's double or nothing. Wouldn't mind a few rounds of cards. Double or nothing. All Add right. the spy? I, really? I hate the spy card. All right, I'm going to put another prediction up if you want to okay. try. I'll try this. I'll add the spy, but I really don't like it. Why don't you like it? Uh, I just don't like that the way it goes. Um, let me pull out somebody then. Um, Who's that? Oh, never mind. Who's that lady with the big buns? The poor fucking infantry. Which one? She's two buns right there. Yeah, she's an archer. Sile? She's an archer. Yeah, we gotta win. So I know Spy gives me two additional cards, but it gives them five points. Let's try it. You will go first. You still believe in me? All right, we'll take the Spy. All right, so we have... Do you have to pat? Do you have to send cards back or no? What do you mean? Do you have to redraw two cards? I think I do. Right? Spies are great. You like them. All right. Well, I haven't figured out how to like them. No, no you don't have to. Okay. You can skip your redraw. Uh, how do I skip my redraw then? I don't know. How do I skip it? All or nothing. Um, uh, just pressing... Let's press circle. Okay. I'm gonna keep it like this. Okay. Alright, we send out our clownfish first. Yarpin, go do what you were born to do, Yarpin. Oh? So they put a spy on me. And I gotta diversify my assets here. Oh. Archery boy. That's is that a hero card when it has that extra? Do you want to play some Gwent? I do. Alright, so archery, we're gonna go. See, I kind of... Do you, do you always play your strongest stuff in the first round? I, I have a tendency to, uh, like... Over-muscle the first round. Opponent's turn. Scorch! Okay, so they just scorch their own... That's interesting. So they scorch their own deal. Hmm. They scorch their own highest card off my side. I like this one. But that's from your discard pile. So can I, is that, can I pull that card out of my disc? I'll keep the healer for later. We have to save stuff for later rounds, I know that, but. I can't, if I pass now, he'll beat me. We can pull this spy back up. All right, sweet. Biting frost, typical, typical shit. Typical shit, my dude. But, it was a clear, cool day. Yup. Now he's gonna do something, and now the frost is coming up. Oh, more frost? Okay. Well, then it's gonna get real foggy right about here. Oh, you put yourself below. 
that thing? I don't even know what that card does. What was that one? I don't know. Oi! Mmm. Mmm, mmm, my blunder. Use the spy and give him one point, maybe? Yeah, that's not a bad idea. So, we're down by three points. I'm gonna go for this mega, I mean, I'm just gonna go for this one here. Yeah, I do appreciate you guys trying to help me, but I won't be able to take advice from all of you at the same time for obvious reasons. Um, I'm gonna do this and hope that he has no more weather cards. Torrential rain, etc. Pass you clown. Commander's horn. Mm -hmm. Still works even in the frost. I'm going to go all the way on this one. But you still have a couple more rounds. But there's only two rounds if you win both of them. Oh, okay. I'm trying to I'm trying to use up all of his all of his cards. I'm going to save my medic. Commander's Horn is really good. This guy's definitely got better cards than I do. Is, it, is now the time to pass, or do we use the Medic? This I will summon your, your input on. Mm -hmm. Use the Medic. Skip. Pass. Pass. I think I need to pass. Yeah. Because he's, he's, he's going to have to clear the f weather. That guy's worth one point, two points. Ah! ah. Didn't expect that shit. guys. Amelia's getting anxious. She's not happy. <laughs> Thank you for the spy. So I don't understand how that works. They play the card on my side, so I get five points on, added to my shit. Mm -hmm. But they get to draw up two cards. Oh. Okay. So they, they're doing that to add cards to their deck. I'm gonna play the medic now, I think. Yeah. So now, because I've played the Medic, I can go through my discard pile and pull back any card, and I'm going to take my Catapult. All or nothing now. This is... Oh! I know some of you are pros, and you're like, No, what are you doing? But... I'm going for it. Commander's Horn! He's got so many... Always use spies? See, that's interesting. I actually, like, totally hated the experience of using the spies. I'm gonna pass, because that's all I got. Use rain? Oh, shit. No, I, I don't want to use rain. Rain would stop my own, my own deal. We won the round. Alright, alright. Yeah, just so you know, this is the first guy I'm playing Gwent with that's not the scholar from the very beginning of the game. But now we send out our humble little uh, siege expert just to get him nervous. <laughs> and they pass. And the siege expert wins the day. Nice. Hey. Give me those coins. Give me those coins. Victory. <laughs> I'm proud of you. Thanks, babe. All right. You won. Choose outcome. We won. We won. Thank you, Nilfgaardian nobleman, for training me up. Okay, so you guys have changed my opinion of the of the spy card completely. I will. I'm out of here. Travel to Velen. Switch to the world map. All right, friends, we're traveling. <laughs> Let's get cruising. To open the world map of a given region, press X. And get me there. Ooh, to the hanged man's tree. Ugh. Geralt Let us go. and Yennefer were reunited. Something even more important happened in Vizima. Geralt learned that Cirilla, his one time ward, had returned from afar, and she was in danger. He was to find her at the Emperor's command and Yennefer's behest. Yeah, so we, we, we lost five the first round, but we won 20 the second round, so. Nice. It got better. It got better. Oh, hey, gamer. Welcome back for two months. All right, I'm being advised by my moderators that I am now beginning the real game and the rest was just a prologue. Oh. Which I think is about right. All right. White Orchard's about 10% of the game, right? 
Velen, North Temeria, five days later. Gotta be Temeria. Temeria, or Temeria. Temeria. The game starts now. Uh, oh, they've been there for some time. Well, some more than others. You got, a, you got a raven on your head, bro. Don't, don't eat it. Oh, bad. Mmm. This tree's got bad energy. I would say that tree is full. Mm. Not ominous, no. <laughs> Look at all the world that we have yet to explore. Oh, you guys, I feel freed. Manual save reminder from my good man Debo. Just gonna keep on saving every time. Mm -hmm. Yep, 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 yep. The Ravens are having a great day. Yeah. Hearts of Stone. Thank you for purchasing the Hearts of Stone expansion. I didn't, but I bought the, year, the game of the year version, which comes with it. Your currently tracked quest has been changed to the first quest of Hearts of Stone, yet we only recommend starting if your character is level 30. No. <laughs> we are not level 30. We are level 4. So we want to get on with the quest difficulty. And, uh, Gamer, yes, we are playing this on the PS5. Yes, we are. Alright, go to the in typical adventuring stuff. You guys know the, you know the drill. Get to the end. To the inn. Rune right, same deal. Um, you can encounter Rune right expansion stuff marked with a book. Uh, this is new craftsman, one of a kind, far Whoa. off land. Blood and wine. Welcome to the blood and wine thing. Also included in the game of the year edition. We're going to the inn. Well, it looks really pretty around here. I like all the flowers. There's a wild dog over there. Yeah. Wild pack of family dogs came running through my yard one day. My own dog ran away with them. Oh. Yeah, it's a song. All right. Come on. Sorry, guys, but I just, I like dogs, but not wild dogs. And I also have learned some new skills. Hello, wild dogs. It's me. <laughs> Hungry boys! I need your dog tallow for my collection. Like I'm molding. Are you molding dogs? Looks like it. Oi! All right, time to drink some water and some raw meat. Collect the tallow. I need all your tallow. All your tallow will belong to us. Tallow, tallow, tallow. Uh, L Whammies, welcome back for two months. And Abby Chester, thanks for subscribing. Cheesy Choppers is cheering with Hawk and Wolf and Re3. Hum fiber? Mm-hmm. Hum fiber? A Deviant Sponge, thank you for cheering as well. There is too many hanging bodies in this town for me to like it. Roach, we need to get out of here. My wife does not like to see hanging bodies. Not so. Oh, yeah, it automatically equip my old armor. All right, we want this. Uh, which one did I get here? Plus six? No, plus 12. This is my. No, no, this one is the best one. Yep. Plus 25. Don't need to double click. What kind of boots we got? That are made for walking? And that's just what they'll do. One of these days, these boots are gonna walk all over the land. Yeah, don't. Maybe we can sell some of those. This is my hunting trousers. Make sure I have all my, my nicest swords. Okay, so I need to. That sword is in, in bad shape. And then let's check in with our oils, too, because we have many oils which we can readily apply but we have no beast oil so these are more specific for specters cursed beings and necrophanges which is don't even don't even start that's that roach yeah that's it roach oh i'm so glad the whole world opened up Oh, 
Hello, I'm a humble traveler. We have to equip skills again too? All that stuff got taken off? No. Oh yeah, we do have one more. Um, let's go for... Uh, this one is... Ard. Maybe I like my... My alchemy stuff we can do. Is this just when we're mix, mixing and matching? Increase potion overdose threshold. Poisoned blades. I'm going to use my poisoned blades. Oh, you want the gourmet one? Alright, we can do the gourmet one. That's doable. Delicious gourmet. Excellent. Alright, so the gourmet is going to help my vitality. Onward. Going to the inn. To play more Gwent. Step away. Chaplain's <laughs> pride. Can't you see? Mommy Dollar, thank you for the gift sub to roach the horse. Uh oh. Wild dogs again. I know y'all are like, please stop, stop fighting these wild dogs. They're coming for my roach. <laughs> You guys know I killed a bear one time? Not even bad. <laughs> Joy use glorious. Thank you for subscribing and Rubik's thanks for cheering. Appreciate you all. And Warcry Mango, thanks for the gift sub to Lija. Thank you, Warcry Mango. Okay. A bear? Yeah. You guys don't believe me? You don't believe me I killed a bear? Check this shit out. What do you got here, Bri? What are you carrying around with you? Not one, but two bear hides somewhere. Did I get a white a white bear hide is junk? Anyway, I killed two bears. Took me a long time. I ran around in circles. Ran around in circles. And, uh, I was nervous the whole time. <laughs> There's too many hanging bodies in this town. Yeah, there's a lot of dogs around here too for the same reason. I may have looted the white bear hide Faster. from somewhere else, but I, I totally killed two bears. No, no, you guys are like, no, there's no way that man killed two bears, but he did. <laughs> <laughs> he killed them. They're, they're hanging around. Strangers coming! Run for your lives! You don't have to run, I'll it's not just me. Up. Not on me life! You guys wanna play Gwen? <laughs> hey man, you got any Gwen? Around here? You have to ask about the agent. Looking for a man. Goes by Hendrik. What do you want with him? Wanna talk to him. What about? Give me a bottle of something strong. Mmm, espresso. You gotta go. I'll open the back way for you. Well, I was... I, I, I haven't finished my drink. Haven't finished my drink yet. In Cape, vodka. Who's this in? Brave warrior looks like. Got two swords, see? You guys wanna play Gwent? Oi! Great boy! What's the point of having two swords? Wonder if he keeps an extra prick in his trousers too. You fucking deaf! Gonna say who you are? Or do I need to loosen your tongue with me knife? I will literally murder you. <laughs> mm, yeah, I will I will I will literally murder you. Someone who'd prefer not to be bothered while he's having a drink. <laughs> Hear that? We've a distinguished gentleman in our midst. Shine the last time I was in an inn, I chopped like six no. guys up. Wouldn't want the grime in your hands to rub off on them. Bolo, did you hear what I heard? I will loot your body as well. Go away. We have an emote for that. You. Damn it. Enough. 
I know. Yo, <laughs> these guys are clowning. Uh, how long are you gonna make me win? Have you any idea what the Baron will do when he learns of this butchery? The village! He'll tear it apart before anyone can say it was some wandering mutant done it. An iron fist he's got! Put him in a swamp. Where's Hendrik? You deaf? You understand what I'm saying? Baron won't let this stand! Calm down. Your Baron's no idiot. Seriously doubt he'll think you locals cut his men down with farming implements. Now where's Hendrik? Man lives in Heatherton. Don't know where that is. Other side of the hill. Looked that away this morning and saw a strange glow. Imperials on the raid, perhaps. But who knows? All right, bye. <laughs> no. Anything else you can tell me about Hendrik? Odd fellow. Arrived from who knows where and for no apparent reason. Shacked up with a widow whose husband was stabbed for a scrap of bread. Baron's men don't like strangers. Aye. He stays out of their way. Always seems to know when they're coming. Always manages to disappear. Thanks, Inkeep. Go out the back. More of the Baron's men in the village. No need to worry about me. I'd rather yeah. you not make any more trouble for yourself, for us both. Alright, I just yeah. gotta loot. I gotta loot these. We're all gone. Oh, what the? You cleaned them up so fast. I was gonna. I was gonna totally loot those guys. Oh, here we go. Here's some loot. Grilled pork. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, that guy turned into some grilled pork. <laughs> hey, a deviant sponge. Thank you for the gift subs. Thank you, a deviant sponge. Appreciate you very much, friend. Thanks a lot. And yeah. low yeah. Laura Bobora. Oh, this guy. Oh. A bandit. Oh, Woo! shit. <laughs> All right, I do need to leave. I understand what you're saying, Inkeep. I, I really shouldn't stick around. Where did he come from, man? Yeah, I gotta Laura go. Babora, thank you so much for subscribing. Stop. Hammer time. Some guy over here, too, looking at me. He's fine. Are you looking at me? No, no, he's scared. There's a bandit right outside. I'll chop him. What's up? Nothing. Everybody. It's me. I just came to read the. I just came to read the. For a nearby post. I'm looking for a contract. Oh! Let's leave. Let's leave. Let's leave. In twain. Whoa. If you don't know what the word in twain means. It means in half. All oh, this fucking guy. More? More bandits? Here, well, huh? you did just cut someone in twain. Hey, bro. A little fire. A little slice. You never learn. You never learn. The real question is, when you cut a guy in half, which half do you loot? Oh, right in the middle. Let's leave this place. Walking around with your sword out in town gets you into trouble. I've heard that before. What do we got? Ah, missing brother. You can find a missing brother. Uh-huh. Consider yourself informed. Uh, they want a milk cow. They want milk from our cows. Mm-hmm. A warning. In lonely woods, screams carry long shadows creep far in dark, deep dale. Beware ye, then the grove's wild song, or in the wild, will end your tale. Alright, Roach. We're gonna get out of here, because... We gotta stop fighting people like this. Alright, we gotta look for this agent. In the village of Heathrow. Roach! Roach, okay. Roach always surprises me by arriving it, from new, new directions. Go for it. You 
beautiful light in this terrible swamp. Hey everyone, what's going on here? What are you guys doing? Come on. Uh, they're worshipping that. Thank you, Leather Steve. I've got the autosave to set every three minutes, so I'm feeling pretty confident. Wow, that's a nice sunset. <laughs> Ooh. This is Wolfsbane? I love a good Wolfsbane. It is. I've been able to recognize a lot of these plants, you guys. I've been doing a lot of plant collection. Hans Fiber. We love to see it. Fool's Parsley. sense danger. But Brian's senses are different than Wolf Witcher senses, so. Wow, look at this. Isn't it gorgeous? Yeah. I love it here. That's real pretty. Elena with an A, welcome back for two whole years. Hey, welcome back. Welcome back. And yeah, the graphics here are quite stunning, to say the least. They're strange. Like dropping into a deep cellar on a hot day. And the mist. Uh-huh, Nilfgaardian connection. Some uh-oh. This man's having some trouble with some some rabbit dogs. <laughs> Coming dogs. Come on. <laughs> I need this raw meat for my collection. Be gone! Leave me be, whoever you is! Get away! Calm down. It's over. Aye. It's over. All's past, never to be restored. I'll not forget that ever. Looking for a man named Hendrik, supposed to live in this village. Aye, he did. No longer. They nabbed him in that hut. If you'd have heard the cries, sir. If you'd have heard how a man can scream, how he can suffer. Farewell. That's too dark. Tell me about Tell it. me what happened here, step by step. They took him. Took him all. The sun was waning, see? And the dusk went crimson like blood. Thought to myself, strange. The toads. I cannot hear them. and through. Hendrick screamed. Then he begged. By the end, he could do naught but moan. See the chat say the wild hunt, the wild hunt, the wild hunt. Weren't here long, the terrors. Yet the village froze like in the heart of winter. 
You in that hut when they rode off? No. And I'll not set foot there. Never. Farewell, and peace of mind to you. <laughs> oh, poor dude. We need Hendrik. But I see that Harvick has resubscribed for nine months right on time. Thank you for being here, and I'm, we are having fun. Oh, yes. I love the... I love this game, I love the world, and I love collecting dog tallow. Here okay. Hello? Whoa, it's still icy in there. Oh, gotta examine this situation. What bloody man is this? Tortured him. Maybe they missed something. Should search his trouser, his jerkin, or his boots. Should check his boots. Blood congealed. Key hidden in his boot. Gotta fit a keyhole. Somewhere nearby, hopefully. Alright. Well, oh, what's that? pretty clever to search his boot right off the bat. There's a draft. Gotta be a space under this rubble. Guess I should do some cleaning. Witcher's a good detective. Mm hmm Geralt, my man, let's go in there. We. Oh. oh. No, we don't need to go back up. We've only just got here. Aha! Examine this. Hmm. Interesting. Oh. Okay, and what else? Loot? Ooh, 115 crowns is as good as my loot. Missing. Do you want to read it? Tamara Stranger, daughter of the Bloody Baron. Presumed kidnapped. Hearty reward for whoever finds her or brings her in. Okay. What's going on here? Loot. Vile. Ignite. That's so cool. Can anybody do that? Can anybody just raise their hand and light a candle on fire? <gasps> Examine. My beard's kicking in again. A ledger. Payment for a sack of grain. Amount due for a charcoal shipment. Hendrik was masquerading as a merchant. Hmm, what's this? Notes among the ledger entries. Clever. Interesting headings. Clashed with a witch. Subject landed in swamp, encountered a witch. Conflict ensued. Cause unknown. Find the witch. Talk to the peasantry. Village of Midcops. Missing and wanted. Subject appeared in Skellige. Also sighted in Novigrad. Appearance unchanged. Ashen hair. Scar on her face. Avoids contact with others. Hmm. Drunken swine. So-called Baron hosted subject at his castle. Or should I say, illegally appropriated fort. Reason unknown. Talk to Baron at Crow's Perch. Caution advised. I'm being observed. Don't know by whom or why. Unsettling signs. Dog ran off. Water in bucket froze solid. Strange glow observed in the sky. Ill omen, peasants say. Somehow they learned Hendrik was looking for Siri. Thus the torture. I'm too late. My only leads, the Baron, and some witch. Damn. Hmm. To the Baron's castle we go. <laughs> Henrik's note. A ledger. Payment for a sack of grain. Drunken swine. No, so <laughs> <laughs> Your pasta's ready! Yeah! <laughs> Your delivery has arrived! 
<laughs> All right, Roach. All right. Let's get back to work, Roach. Tuber-centric milk. Thanks for cheering. Is that really your ringtone? That's amazing. If it is. <laughs> or your text notification. <laughs> What's your favorite part of the game thus Come far, on, Bri? Um, my favorite part of the game thus far has been, I mean, definitely leveling up. And, and I love, like, you know, getting better armor and uh, weapons and all that kind of stuff. I also have been having fun, like, just kind of going around and picking fights with monsters. Chopping them up. Getting their loot. Um, I love Gwent. Gwent was fun. Uh, I'm definitely going to buy all the Gwent cards I can from the uh, merchants and stuff. I like exploring. I mean, this has got a lot Slow of similarities now. to games Whoa. that really, really have been enjoying. Show like, me what like you all got. Like all these deserters, right? Ah! Oh! Oh! Ah! Okay, I have, an arrow, I have an arrow sticking out of me. So we are to these guys to say thanks for deserting. Oh. How long are you going to make me wait? Oh, this guy. You don't want to run into the woods? You're not scared? You should be. Used to be a bunch of dudes there. Now it's just a pile of loot. That's my favorite part about the game. I think what I'm really... No! What I'm enjoying about the game <laughs> is the magical elements. Um, I think it's really cool how uh, she can cast different spells. And I like Yennefer's powers as well. I like the fantastical element of the game. Yeah, me too. Um, I actually saw Corey Barlow tweet about this, which is my same point of view about Assassin's Creed uh, Black Flag. When, it, when we jumped to the like present time, it totally killed my vibe. Um, ooh, look at all these nice items. Um, and I like that this is like deep dunking me into this medieval, you know, what are we, 1200s, 1400s, mm, yeah. where are we? Um, so for me, it's, it's the immersion, the like deep immersion in a world that's not ours, the, the pure escapism. I'm gonna take a different sword though, because we have been. Is your inventory oh. full? Um, yeah, so I'm overburdened. We're gonna drop this club that we can't use yet. And uh, we- You have a lot of pants that you don't need, don't need but this maybe rusty you can thing. sell that. Listen, if you are out there telling me about having too much inventory, <laughs> I can't carry anymore. <laughs> I can't carry anymore. I can't carry anymore. Rusty swords don't need it. All right, we're good again. Rusty sword, get out of my life. And also, they're not much good for. Although I did drop one non-rusty sword, so so I want that back. All right, now I'm out of here. Like those bandits. I mean. Basically, to answer the question, what do I like the most about the game? It's the crossing all the things off the list. Like, I just love that there's all these little check marks, these question marks that summon me, and then on I will ride to here to discover this undiscovered location together. But we're st we're going towards the Baron's castle, yeah. Yeah, we're going towards the Baron's castle in the in the big scheme. But look at this, ready? This is the Baron's castle. To right? the bloody Baron. This is the Baron. Yeah. So so why not just. You know, pick up a quick question mark along the way. That sounds good. You know? Agreed, agreed. And some white myrtle petals, just here, no problem. We'd love to see it. Of course. Roach. Let's go. Let's go into the tree. I mean, I'm not just saying this because these are open world uh, games with a horse, but like, you know, I've really enjoyed running around in Red Dead Redemption 2. Really enjoy running around in Ghost of Tsushima. Really enjoy running around in Zelda Breath of the Wild. So this game is right up my alley. Although that's I told you that's a question mark I said I was going to go to. Oh, here's a good question while I've got you guys on the stream. Is there... 
Is there any way to add a, I, can, I know I can do a custom marker, but are all the custom markers without the dotted line that show you how to get there, like the best path of this? When we set our own custom marker, we just go towards that, like in the mini map. So here's a bunch of ghouls. The horse's fear level is high. Horse, run away. Save yourself from the ghoul. Keith, thank you for the big cheers. Uh, Follow-up question. Do you have a favorite monster contract that you've completed so far? I did the, the Devil in the Well one. was pretty crazy. Um, but the underwater stuff creeps me out. I really, in games... Um, you know, topper, I, I really get kind of anxious underwater in games. Um, I'm not a good swimmer in real life, but... La, 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 la. All right, gonna, I was gonna add some oil to our blade to show you guys the moves. Necrophage, or is he, what kind of a deal is he? So just to give you an idea, man, um, our bestiary will show us that we are up against a ghoul and a ghoul cannot abide the necrophage oil. Excellent. So we will then, in our inventory, put a little necrophage oil on our blade, our silver sword, so that when we chop him, he gets extra rashes. Oh, he's gonna get rashes. Oh, oh, oh there's so many. <laughs> Should have blown up his barrels they were by. Run away! Oh, you fools. Bad ghoul. He was a bad ghoul. Bad ghoul. Excellent. Is that everybody? That's everybody. Alright, so the ghoul's blood's pretty good to collect, but what we really want to do is blow up their nest. That's their nest? Well, they have a nest there in the ground. Here, I'll show you. Oh, with all the burnt bodies on it? Yeah, and then it's got some loot in there. Ghoul nest. Ghoul nest. Better just destroy it. Better just destroy it. So we put a little bomb on there. <laughs> and then we run away. All right. Uh, Roach, watch out. It's going to explode. Resilient horse. Oh! Now Papa Ghoul come out. Damn, you're ugly. Damn, you're ugly. Oh! That was effective though. Oh, no. Could have gone a bit better. Uh, need to eat some raw meats. Mm, just quick. Three raw meats is good. Good snack of raw meats. Same to you, dude. Show me what you got. Nice. Good taunting. Girl. All right. So now we go collect the loot and we take a hydration break. Oh, another a little a little goal we got to deal with here. Yeah. Stay away from our horse. Stay away from my horse, and I'll set you on fire. Ugly. Yeah. Loot him. Sword and ashes. So those guys will eat pretty much anytime we come across like dead bodies or a battlefield or whatever. Like they're always out there, just I'm over encumbered. Let's take more stuff. Sweet. Uh, I will sort my inventory during our hydration break. We will take five minutes. All right. As is customary for the people. Hey, salty legs. Welcome back for three months and major mops. Thanks for cheering. Hey. And I love the Witcher, I love the Witcher, I love the Witcher. I think that would be uh, my feelings. <laughs> All right. All right. Should we take five? Let's hydrate. Let's take five, and we'll see you guys on the other side. We'll pull a winner for our signed pin and postcard when we come back. And uh, thank you all for being here with us. We'll see you in just a moment.
Click! Click! Hey, welcome back everybody. Welcome back. A neighborhood dragon. Thank you for being here with a gift sub to Lindsay, entering yourself in ten times for our prize. <laughs> Appreciate you all being here with us. Yes. So, we are coming across a bloody baron. Yes, to the bloody baron we go. And as you see, we are only inches away from level five. Inches. Wow. Literally 17. You cleaned up your XP inventory away. just barely. Uh, I, I, I lightened our load just so we're not over encumbered, but then we will sell some stuff to the merchant, which I believe. You yeah. love the Bloody Baron? Well, let's get to the storyline then, shall we? The Bloody Baron. A signpost. Mm. I like to see it. All right. Find the Baron. Excuse me. We're looking for a Baron. So, Hello, uh, everyone's running away. Yeah, they don't like strangers. Selling anything here? I might, I might like to. Raven, thank you for the gifts up to Yamu, Yamaru. Appreciate you. Oh, attacking me right away? What? Nighty night! For the road! Oh, oh cool. shit. I'll hey. punch him in the head. Getting a little woozy. You die in agony! They got a poison arrow or something? What's going on there? Yeah, you're looking not so great. I'm not feeling great either. I'm just gonna loot these bodies and get them on, get on my way. You got too much stuff? Is that what it is? Yeah, again. Get rid of all this shit. I wish there was a drop crappiest item button. I'm gonna... All these swords are better than what I'm carrying around. All right, I'm gonna... I, I see my, my mods uh, suggesting, uh, please no spoilers in the chat. Please, no spoilers in the chat. Because another game came out five years ago, but I'm playing it for the first time, as I've mentioned several times. Well, 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 this axe is nice. 17 up on that. Okay, 
I'm gonna drop this. I don't want that club. Looks like rain. Halt! Who goes there? Missing. Baron home? Not your concern. Need to talk to him. Open the gate. Not a chance. We heard what happened at the crossroads. We'll not let a man like that in here. Oh. Won't get in that way. Gotta find another. Ought to look among the villagers. Might find one brave enough to help me. I'm sure I will. Villagers! Will you help me? Help me help you, villagers. Help me help you. How about that? Takes a tired old man not to panic and run when I appear. Greetings. Greetings to you. Other villagers all scurried off soon as they saw me. You didn't. Oh. Oh, I'm too old to scurry. Besides, what could you do to me? Kill me? Go ahead. I've not long to live. Tamioid wouldn't work. Your skin's right brittle. Okay, very well. <laughs> Lived here long? Hmm. Since I was born. Reckon that'll be more than 70 winters. Must know the area well. Not bad. Listen, I gotta get inside the fortress. Can I do that without going through the front gate? Ye can, but few know the way. If you were to make an humble offering, call it to this humble man, maybe I could point you in the right direction. Yeah, yeah, give it, give it. All right, I'll pay. You could have some pants too, we have a lot of pants. Fine, don't really feel like arguing with the guards. Years back, when the old lord still ruled Crow's Perch, the blacksmith's boy went missing. Old village looked for him. No luck. Finally found the boy in the river. He drowned. Tragic. But how's that supposed to help me? A few days on, an old woman who served the lord found the boy's cap near the castle well. So, either he lost it there or he fell in the well. Clever man. Village folk built a shrine where they found the lad's body, northwest of here. Wait till you find an entrance to a passage nearby. Shrine? Where is it exactly? Track that weaves through the village. Follow it to the bridge. Turn right past that. Then go on, straight as piss, till you get to a crossroads. Turn right again. Then follow that path up a hill. Shrine stands upon it. Right past the bridge, then right again. I'll find it. Thanks. I'm all right. Hi. Enjoy those coin. I won them in Gwent. Do you want to play Gwent? Do you play? Never mind. I gotta go. Nice. Quadra Royals, welcome back. Thanks for subscribing. Yeah, straight as piss is not a really great metaphor because it doesn't necessarily always go straight. I don't know why you couldn't just let that pass. Roach! What am I doing? I have a horse for this sort of thing. That's it, Roach. <sighs> On we go. Bodies, bodies, bodies. There's the shrine. Passage must be somewhere around here. Hmm. Find a cave that leads under the crow's perch.
Which could start a forest fire, I should put that out. You, you can examine it. Mm. I can extinguish it. I saw another option to examine. There it is. Seems I'm in for a swim. No, ah, a swim! HP 600 is here! Hey, 25 months! Welcome wah, wah, back! Uh-oh, what is a water hog? A water hag, even worse! Ah. <gasps> I can't see when you do that! Oh my gosh! Oh, you are foul! Stench. Gosh, you guys, look at this. A water hag. Water hag does not like necrophage oil. Or quen or igni. Folks say water hags are drowners' wives. If that be true, taint no wonder why they're such ornery bitches. <laughs> Ugh. So these are drowners. Alright. And these are water hags. Lovely. Don't like to see it. Don't want. Don't like to see it. Don't want to be it. All right, let's make sure we got enough oil on our blade for that happening again. Necrophage oil mm -hmm. applied. We need to take care of our weapons. Do I want anything for that? Let's see. <clears throat> Can I repair my own weapons, or I gotta take it to the blacksmith, eh? I think I gotta take it to the blacksmith. <laughs> What's well, this one? Amateur weapon repair kit, or journeyman's weapon repair kit. Let's use that one on my silver sword. There we go. And you can repair it with kits you find. Nice, that'll help. Good looking out. Let's loot. What do you think you get? Ooh, venom extract and a water hag tooth. Anybody want to make a necklace on the water hag tooth? Me neither. Ew, in we go. Ooh. Liking this loot thing. Amethyst dust. We'd love to see it. Some diagrams. Oh. A lot of loot. But we need oxygen more than we need loot. Royals, thank you for the gift subs. Hey, thank you so much. Appreciate you. Dive deeper. Thank you, 
Malu. Appreciate you. Disoriented. I hate these water levels, honestly, in all games. I don't like it. I think this is where we came in. But... Yeah. Maybe you go to that side instead of the other side. It's all the same. Are you supposed to be following those little dots, those little white dots in the mini map? That's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to follow the dots in the minimap, you guys, but I kinda get through here. You know? It's kinda nauseating. Yeah. Okay. Why can't I make it through these terrible things? Do I have to go under this, you guys? Help me out here. Um, the cave's mini-map is confusing. Okay, so they're saying sometimes um, maybe try using the sword. Uh, in this case, the dots are pointing to the center of the yellow circle, not the map. Okay. Sometimes it just gets so dark that I, like, just can't. Yeah, maybe can. Do I have a torch? I don't think I have a torch. Or I do down here. I've never used a torch in this game before. my pockets there's a torch what's the shortcut for this there we go <laughs> okay now I've unequipped the torch all right where your signs are okay good thank you guys except Loot and let's have a torch then. Ah. Hey. Much better. Much better. Thanks, team. I would be looking for that forever without you. Lots of runes. Hunting gauntlets to weigh us down. Need to get a. I'm throwing away these extra pants. Yeah, you don't need those pants. These pants are worth 46, not for me. Get out of here, pants. Alright, so once we're in this uh, circle. Wolf and silver sword, sweet. That's the pants we left. We're gonna have to dive again. Yeah, we'll sell stuff to get the monies when that's an option. But I'm not gonna carry around all that shit until then. Okay, so... We're on the other side of that now.
All right, guys, when I see this kind of jaggedy uh, cave shit, I can't get through that, right? Like, there's no... There's no squeezing through it. Climb on the rocks. Do you see any rocks I'm looking white? for it. Can I climb you? This doesn't feel right. Thank you, Anonymous. I'm only a humble level four witcher. How could I climb <laughs> so effortlessly? A lot of shrooms in this place. Mm -hmm. Do you guys love to get the shrooms every time you can, or should we just let them be? I don't know. I don't know what they make. Ooh. That seems bad. Here it is. I'm gonna ignite this. Zima. Now those were balls. Attended a few, me and my Annie. Oh, how we danced, how we twirled. <laughs> oh! One, two, three. One, two, three. Hey! <laughs> Enough. I don't care how you do it, but the deliveries must be weekly. Won't you stay for tea? No. Besides, like to me. you've another mm. guest. Uh -huh. Here's me, I came popping out of the well. The defender of the downtrodden. Greetings. News gets around quick. That it does. When I learned you'd slaughtered my men, I thought to have you captured and hanged. Or at least flogged. But then I thought one tough cocker if he bested that lot of cutthroats. Man like him could prove useful. I'm no thug for hire. Uh, on occasion, I am, though. I would... Uh, would you, yeah, all right, fine. What? What are, you, what are you talking about? Useful. How? That's the spirit. We'll work well together. I can see that already. This way. One thing. You do well to behave this time. Remember, I've still to decide what to do with you. Which I shall do after we've spoken. Bayrak, thanks for subscribing with your Prime friend. Welcome. Make yourself at home. Hey, where'd I put the bloody vodka? Ah, there it is. A snifter. No thanks. Didn't come here to drink. <laughs> As you will. But I'll not sit here to dry if you don't mind. Before the war, there was a distillery nearby, best in Velen. But the horse on was burnt it to the ground. To the matter at hand, I'm Philip Stranger. Now the blobtits round here call me the Bloody Baron. Geralt of Rivia. Blobtits call me the Butcher of Blaviken. I know who you are. Truth be told, it's the only reason we're talking. How do you like it here in Velen? Didn't come here to talk about the scenery. You're wrong to avoid the topic. You've just arrived, plain to see. And the local swamps and bogs, they're interesting to say the least. Someone loses their way around here, he becomes damn hard to find. 
What are you getting at? Many have lost loved ones here. Some their wives, others their daughters. Get to the point already. Siri, that's why you've come, isn't it? So she was here. She showed up some time ago, exhausted, wounded, and stinking like a soaked hound after a hard hunt. Later, I learned she'd come from the swamp. Said some beasts from the woods attacked her before she could reach the village. changes when you play as Siri you cannot access the inventory or use signs all the riverbed to find help you want to follow the riverbed to find help let's leave this place sure oh, I don't know what I just did I don't think I should play this I haven't played okay, any fine. on work obtain I need help Come down. Oh, never mind. It's just a child. Just a child creeping in the trees. Hello there. Are you lost? A little, I guess. Are you? Mm, no. I never lose my way. Ooh. If that's true, what are you doing so deep in the forest alone? Looking for lost little girls. What happened to you? This? It's nothing. Mm. Why are you here? How did you wind up here? My father brought me. Told me to follow the trail of treats and eat my fill. He said he would wait. So I started down the trail. But then I saw a butterfly. And I ran to catch it. And I lost my way. You and your father, when did you leave home? This morning. And did the sun warm your face or your back? It warmed my back. So we must go east. Come, I'll walk you home. And explain to your parents that they must not lose their children in the woods. We can't go home because of the Wolf King and his pack. Wolf King. No kings among wolves. These have one. And you've seen him? Yes. I mean, no. From behind a tree. He was huge, with giant eyes and great fangs, and he was terribly, disgustably horrific. Hmm. <laughs> Don't be afraid, I'll protect you. See what I've got on my back? Wolves fear it. Kings do too. Come, I'll help you up. <sighs> Mar Santo, welcome back for two years, friend. Mm -hmm. Thank you. So, Gretka, want to chat? Wolves! Oh. Quick, hide! Watch out, child. <laughs> Oh, that's a lot. 
Anything to help us? Nope. Child. You can come out now. My <sighs> Hmm. Massacred. By something with immense claws. Hmm. Massacred. By something, something with, with immense, immense claws. claws. Even more immense than these wolves. Yep. Seems to be. Alright, Greca. Look! There's something there. Gross! Oh, is that your dad? Wait here. Don't come any closer. Gross, but... is that your No buts, dad? stay here. I must see something. We're playing on story and sword, for those of you who are curious. It is the second option. Uh. Looks like he has a bad leg. <sighs> Something tore his leg off. No, gnawed it off. Ew, that's horrible. Stay there and look away. Hmm, what's this? Marrow's missing. Interesting. Ew. What about his eyes? <sighs> Bloodshot, but still moist. He died recently. Lips parted and bloated. Bit clear through his tongue. Immense pain before death. Ah, his chest is crushed. Ribs probably pierced his lungs. Something picked him up and threw him against the tree. But what about his belly? Let's see. His liver's gone. Damn it! Why are you digging through his there. belly? Would you mind making certain your laces are tied? The Wolf King's no fantasy, it seems. Except he's a werewolf. What happened a to him? A werewolf? He had a fall. <laughs> My bet. The Wolf King got him. <laughs> when did children get so smart? What will we do when the Wolf King finds us? Good question. I've no silver, but I can make a blade oil. Oil? You mean like we make from rapeseed? No, a far more special oil. Of dog tallow, wolf's bane, fool's parsley, and wolf's liver. The Wolf King will feel terrible, terrible pain. You're smart. How do you know these things? Did your father teach you? Not my father. My uncle. Uncle Vesemir. Yeah. Uncle Vesemir, we love him. Okay, so you need some stuff. Need some wolf Spain. Now two fools parsley. I also want to collect this mistletoe for my own collection. Come along, child. That? often send their children out to follow the sweets. Sometimes they send their children. Sometimes they go themselves. Do they return? No. Why would they? They've plenty to eat when the path ends. This 
way. Through the cave. You lead. For a spot where I can build a fire and brew the oil in peace. Let's brew some oil. Oh man, this werewolf gonna be a situation. What you doing? Greasing my blade. There. there. See just how effective Uncle Vesemir's formulae are. Now we have the oil on our blade, will be more dangerous. Excellent. Come on, Greta. Elena Resh, thank you for being here for five months. Appreciate you hanging out with us. Appreciate you. It's a sunken wolf. Rekka, you are very slow. I'm supposed to follow you, but good God, child. <laughs> Let's go. Let's get a move on it, child. No cave. It's a bit dark. Afraid? Are you? No. Yes. I am afraid. <clears throat> hey, what? The Wolf King, now do you believe me? I do. Hide. your bits. Yeah! Yeah! Really give him a drop it. Never seen anything like it. Girl, you can come out now. Come on. GG Wolf Boy. GG. So we found a corpse in the woods. <laughs> You're lucky we came this way. Found someone far less fortunate in the forest. Must be. We was returning from Midcops when the brute attacked. I managed to flee, but Yaren the The little one. No details. Well, we're out of here. You have bandages at home. Some spirit? He laid a claw or two on me, unfortunately. Well, I've I've not missed, but my lord, he's a powerful man. He's sure to help you. Might even reward you for cutting the werewolf down. Very well. Lead us to your lord. Made short work of that. I'll tell you what, man. She's got some sweet dodges. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Colombo. Thanks for the gift sub, too. Yeah! yeah! Just who do you think you brought me, man? That's not me daughter. And the little one? Neither, damn it! I think <laughs> I'd know my own child. Well, it might, might not be yours, the older one, but you've got to admit the likeness. That's downright striking. So, any chance for that reward? You'll not see one fucking copper. Get out before I set my hands on you. So, stew any good? Very, thank you. I'd not eaten in. Clear to see. I'm pleased you like it. Had them prepare a bath for you once you've eaten, and you could do with some sleep. Gretka in the nook behind the hearth. You in the guest room opposite the kitchen. Thank you. I. Shh. Eat now. We'll speak once you've rested.
So I ordered my men to watch her and left her to rest. And? Ah, a topic for another time. Mm, no, tell me, tell me now. I want, I need to find her. Understand? I need every last bit of information available. I understand. But you see, it so happens my wife and daughter are missing as well. I propose an exchange. Find my loved ones, and I shall tell you about the girl you seek. All I know. It's kind of fucked up, honestly, but, uh... I'll do it. Fine. I'll help you. I'll find your family. But then you'll give me every bit of information you have. You have my word. When do you see them last? They vanished after the new moon, as if whisked away by shadows. What do you mean, vanished? Precisely that. I awoke one morn to find them gone. I'll need to know a lot more than that. Can I see their rooms? What for? I need clues. Anything to latch on to. I'll not let a stranger pour through their belongings. Want me to find them or not? I do. Then let me work. <sighs> Fine. But I shall go with you. The doors are locked. Level five. We got a point. Yeah! yeah! When she was a babe, my daughter loved animals. Saw a deer trophy on the wall once. Do you know what she asked? Haven't got a clue. Papa, is that deer's womp on the other side of the wall? I think it does. You see it there? Oh, oh, what's a trophy? <laughs> I pity any bastard who's hurt her. I'll flay him alive. Here it is. D damn it! Jammed again. Your bedchamber. Tamara's room is there. Get out of my sight. Try not to make a mess. For their return, I want everything to be as they left it. Mm. Everything? Yeah, right. I'm over encumbered. Examine this though. Wooden candlestick. Stems broken. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. What else is going on in here? Uh huh. Walls a different color. Something used to hang here. Hmm. Mm -hmm. That painting? Right size. Was it this painting? Oh, some loot, you say? Anybody see that? I didn't see anything. The Baron and his wife. <laughs> Look happy enough. Let's move this and see what's behind what's us. What's this? Huh. Gotta wonder who wanted to hide the hole. And what's on the other side. Yeah, we're gonna have to open this up. Hmm, it gets interesting. Piece of wood looks like the stem of that candlestick. No coincidence there. Hmm, fight might have happened here. I don't look for clues. Fresh flowers. He expects them to return any minute. Takes hope. Deep nicks. Hit with a heavy object. Like a candlestick? Oh, what's that on the floor? Blood? Huh. Rest of the candlestick. And wow. the wine stains. wine stains. Somebody smashed a bottle from Toussaint. Yeah. Ervalus. Scent hasn't died. Wonder where it'll lead me. the scent to the other room oh here's some stuff over here just a little bit of stuff just a little bit just doing my work just a man little prick 
So that smell goes down there. I'm gonna check this out here real quick, though. Incense. That. And an old key. No wooden locks. Need all that. Anise. Not a mess. Sandalwood. And something else. We are more like family. We support each other and help each other survive tough moments, grapple with the past, for each of us has a past. So you needn't worry that anyone about anyone digging into yours. We've got a rule. Never ask more than someone offers on their own. The past doesn't matter to us. Only the future does. That and our common fight against evil and depravity, against perverse and loathsome practices of all kinds. Hmm. I don't really want the doll, or maybe I'll have the candy. I'll have the candy. You can keep the doll. The doll you keep, and I'll tell you why. Hmm. Damn ugly for a doll. The kind you'd stick with pins to hurt someone. Oh no. Into evil witcher shit. Use the witcher sense. So we're gonna follow that smell out of the room. Mm -hmm. Nothing else in here for us. Out of my sight. I am. I'm getting out of your Damn, sight, but... trail breaks off. Could find something else though. Mm. Spruce wood. Smells of juniper incense. Some sort of folk talisman. Protective. Question is, against what? Won't find much else here. All right, Baron. What's going on with this talisman situation? Hello. Hello. <laughs> Neither one of you are the Baron. <laughs> oh! We could loot a lot of stuff in here, but that's not what we want. Talk to the Baron about what we found. <coughs> you guys know where the Baron's at? Fucking shit eater. I'm gonna talk to him, maybe he's upstairs. Yeah. Downstairs. Hey, Baron. We gotta have a chat. Done poking around. Well, yeah, I found a doll. Found a doll in Tamara's room. Tell me about it. What could possibly be so interesting about a doll, Witcher? Looks like it might have been used for some sort of black magic. Where'd Tamara get it? Black magic? Are you balmy? I made it for her. She was four, perhaps five winters old. We were in Vizima on market day and she saw the sorceress, Triss Merigold. Insisted she must have a doll just like her. Couldn't afford a thing of that sort, so I made the doll with my own hands. So it is supposed to be Triss. Yeah, I see it now. Eerie. Looks just like her. Doesn't it? Time's taken a bit of a towel, but overall it continues to impress. You got something to fall back on if things don't work out with Nilfgaard. There was a fight in the room. Found signs of a fight in the room. Know anything about that? A fight? What are you talking about? Someone was attacked. Probably your wife or daughter. Whoever it was tried to defend themselves with a candlestick. Missed the attacker. Punctured the wall instead. They tussled too. I... I don't know nothing about this. That night, I was drunk. Don't remember a thing. They were gone by the time I awoke. Doubt you were the only ones in the castle. Maybe one of your men heard something? Three times I asked those bastards if they'd seen anything, heard anything. Nothing! Not a one of them! Probably stop paying those guards. Recognize this amulet? Hmm. Yes. Anna began wearing it a time ago. Any idea where she got it? None. Any witches or cunning women in the area? A Pella. Old Coot lives near Blackbow. And there's a cunning woman in Midcops, but I know little about her. She's only recently arrived. If Anna were to see someone, she'd choose the Pella, not the woman. 
Anna was wary of strangers, newcomers. All right. I to have a chat with this fellow. Fair warning, he's a hard man to talk to. Rumor has it he killed his own father with an axe as a lad, then went batty. Now they say he sees ghosts and plows his goat. Not really interested in his hobbies. Just want to ask about the amulet. Gross. Gross, dude. All right, we got a lot of stuff we got to sell. Mm -hmm. And we're going to go find the Peller's Hut. But that will continue on the next stream, I do believe, because it's time to pull a winner for a prize. Yes. So, we have got this Play the Positive <laughs> pin, which you can only get as a prize on our stream. And uh, we send them out with a signed thank you postcard as our way of saying thank you so much for joining us. And um, the way to win is just by making sure you're following the channel and type something into the chat. Our subscribers get five times entry. And if you gave a gift sub, one or many, you are entered in 10 times. Yeah, we appreciate so. you all being here with us, playing The Witcher and tomorrow. Little nightmares too. too. Extra creepy, this time with more creep. <laughs> and on Wednesdays, if you're about it, we like to play some wholesome games. We're playing Concrete Genie at 4 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, which is one hour later than whatever time it is for you right, right about now. now. All right, friends, a couple more seconds to type a thing into the chat, and we will pull a winner for our prize. I will get to the gong of winning. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, well, this is interesting. We've done a lot of adventuring. Yeah. We've covered a lot of ground. I know. I'm glad to have unlocked another uh, world, you know, segment of the map, mm -hmm. uh, so I can do some leveling up and stuff in between. If you are about The Witcher and you want to join me for some side quests and stuff, make sure you've got your notifications turned on on Twitch. I'm going to be jumping on every now and then uh, and playing a little extra bonus Witcher with the notification squad where we don't tweet about it or post about it and all that kind of stuff we just go live and play games yes uh thank you guys for the game recommendations and one quick shout out that if you want to recommend a game this panel down below the video is where you can type in what game you'd like to see us play mm -hmm. and then we will play it put all that information together to determine the best approach <laughs> time to pull a winner all right are you ready yes all warmed up with the the gong of winning three two one <laughs> We got my uh, Miyaka Eitenarium. Yes. Did I say that right? <laughs> Congratulations. You're going to get a message from Colorful Mess 18, who's our moderator in charge of prizes. So make sure you have your whispers turned on so that you can get contacted for your pin prize. And uh, we will be shipping those out. Uh, about once a month. About once a month. Honestly, it's a little faster than that now, but about once a month. So thank you for your patience as the prizes are shipped most excellent Ripa. thank you izzy bell thank you for being here for five months and amy versus thank you for the cheers so we've got an important decision to make yes which is where shall we raid together mm. and uh amelia rose perhaps you can explain how a raid works if they've not been on a raid before well first things first we're going to poll to figure out where to raid and then once we decide on that we're all going to teleport over to a this other streamers channel together and when we get there we love to shower them with uh, positive emotes and if you like what they're up to smash their follow button and yeah just shower them with some good vibes yep 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 and we've got three options of where to raid here so you can type one two or three in the stream chat on twitch and help us decide if we should raid to zelda breath of the wild that's number one animal crossing number two or cyberpunk 2077 three. check it out one two or three in the chat let's decide where we should raid my friends and thank you again to our awesome mod team mm -hmm. to our lieutenants to our friends on Twitch and on Discord, and a special shout out to all of our subscribers in Roach Garden and Yeniko. <laughs> Appreciate you all. Thank you for hanging out with us. Thank you guys for uh, the pro tips when we get stuck. And uh, thank you for being so cool about all the spoilers. And uh, I know a yeah. lot of you have played so much of this game that you'll you'll know literally everything coming around the corner. We appreciate your pro <clears throat> tips. We appreciate you all. Looks like it's going to be... Cyberpunk. Cyberpunk 2077. All right, now let's go, let it go for a couple more seconds. If anybody else wants to get their vote in there, type 
one, two, or three into the chat, and we will all raid together. We'll continue next Sunday with The Witcher. No, Saturday with The Witcher. Yes. Uh, if not before with the bonus stream, so check your notifications, and we will be... Little nightmares. Three hours earlier than whatever time it is for you right now. Thank you guys for joining us. Appreciate you being here. Madison Ikea. 30 months. Woot what? woot. Back for 30 months. <laughs> wow. Thank you for supporting us for all that time. And Singer, thank you so much for the cheers. We enjoy spending time with all of you. Hey, thank you all for being here with us. We appreciate it. All right. That's a cyberpunk raid. That's a cyberpunk raid. Let's go show some cyberpunk love. So we. Yo. And if you guys want to check out our cyberpunk playthrough is up on our YouTube channel. We are mm -hmm. currently uploading uh, Tell Me Why. Uh, is our current playthrough we're uploading, and then I'll start uploading Assassin's Creed Black Flag. Ah. Arr, if you guys are about it. All right, let's go show some love. Here we go. And uh, let me copy paste this for the raid. Appreciate you all being here. Thank you, thank you, thank you for joining us. Uh, here we go. We hope you have a lovely time zone, friends. Thank you so much for joining us for The Witcher 3. Yeah. And uh, we'll see you tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, we'll be here. We'll be here. Literally right here with all of you. Uh, we'll see you guys very, very soon. The raid is getting queued up and almost ready to go. So then we say, my name is Brian. My name is Amelia. And this, this is, is our, our Twitch. Twitch. That's the way we end it. Wow. <laughs> almost three years, you guys. Holy cow. I know. That's a nice raid. Let's go show some love, eh? All yeah. right. The raid goes in three, two. two. Get all your emotes ready and drop some follows. We're going for a cyberpunk raid. Three, two, two one. one. Raid! Raid, 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 raid. raid.